According to Volvo safety experts, the new XC60 is the safest Volvo ever. In fact, it would be no exaggeration to say that this car contains 80 years of collected safety expertise. Not only have we further enhanced the existing protective safety systems such as the airbags and crumple zones and those kind of technologies, but we've also taken a further step uh, with preventative safety and offering a complete range of technologies in that area. The XC60 that will be built here at Volvo's factory in Ghent in Belgium will have city safety as standard. This is a unique collision avoidance and mitigation technique that using laser sensors helps avoid collisions at low speeds. If the driver does not react, the car does the braking itself. City safety is a low speed collision avoidance and mitigation system. And I think we're really making a statement here addressing a large majority of accidents on our road uh, that occurs in these speeds, uh, taking another step when it comes to uh, whiplash type of injuries on our roads. 75% of all reported collisions occur at relatively low speeds of up to 30 kilometers an hour and are fairly common accidents in city traffic. Unnecessary traffic queue accidents that cost both huge amounts of money and suffering. The benefit is both for the one in the car by, you know, not ending up in an accident, but also by not having uh, exposed others for the accident as well. So reducing accidents and also reducing injuries. The new XC60 also has several other safety features that function in conjunction with the city safety system. This is a really smart car. Using the same sensor, for instance, that we have for city safety, we're also pre-preparing pre the restraints so they know beforehand what will come up and then adjust the force levels in the, uh, in the restraint system based on that information. And uh, so basically the car has eyes. And Volvo's traffic safety researchers are convinced that if this technique was built into the majority of newly manufactured cars, then many traffic accidents could be avoided. Already today, discussions are being held with insurance companies concerning lower premiums for cars equipped with city safety. The benefit is huge if it's installed in more cars. Just by installing it in, in some cars, we will reduce the accidents. And eventually, when it's installed in every car, we will maybe up, end up having no accident in a specific severity interval. The Swedish Road Administration, that also actively works with preventive traffic safety, estimates that the number of whiplash injuries that are a serious problem today would be radically reduced with the help of this technique. In Sweden we have had a fairly long tradition of research into the field of whiplash. We have accepted whiplash as a major uh, problem in traffic. So we have done epidemiological studies seeing what is the frequency of this injury. Uh, and from that we have also seen that car manufacturers have started to look at solutions to protect from whiplash. We have also in Sweden developed the research and development tools needed in form of a good crash test dummy uh, developed especially for whiplash protection assessment. Volvo's traffic safety research that has achieved major successes in recent years continually sets up new goals. And despite the fact that it sounds almost unrealistic, they believe that in the future it will be quite possible to create a traffic environment where cars simply cannot crash with each other. Well, in the future we will have more of these type of systems. Systems in the car, systems communicating between the cars, systems communicating between the cars and the infrastructure, leading to reducing accidents even more. <laughs>